Hello, hello, Maha RR. This is your Madam L. <laughs> Shut up. So, today, for today's video, guys, I have a story time for you. So, we were originally planning on getting groceries and just cooking at home, but we all felt lazy to cook everything up. So, what ended up happening is we went to a restaurant near our home called Shadow Shang. And we didn't know that it was like a formal dining restaurant. And because we were just really originally planning to get groceries, we were all wearing friggin' flip-flops and just like this shirt and um, shorts. Like we weren't all formal. Like, and, and we didn't know. We didn't know from the, um, from the place. Like when we, when we looked it up, we just wanted to have dinner and we saw that this restaurant has good reviews, like it has four point something stars with a few hundred reviews. And so that's when we decided to go, but we didn't really look it up if it's just like a, a formal dining restaurant, which it ended up being one. And so when we went in, like everyone's wearing kind of formal, casual, um, smart, casual attire. And, and all of us are in flip, flip flops. So I'm going to show you um, some videos and some photos, but I wanted to share like how um, one nice Asian lady um, has served us very well with, with just a consistent smile on her face. But there's another one, there's another server there who is giving us attitude and she's just treating us differently. And I think it's because of what we were wearing. So I'm gonna tell you more. Um, in this video. Thank you. Okay, so imagine this. Imagine just walking in. The interior of the re restaurant looks like this. And the table setting is done like that. And we were all wearing flip-flops. We were all wearing shorts and kind of faded t-shirt. So when we walked in, we asked one of the servers. She's a white lady. Um, to see if she can um, sit us down. And she said one minute and then she walked away. There's a lot of tables empty. And then the Asian lady had, had us to um, sit down. She assisted us to sit down. And this is their menu. This is their appetizers. Th these are their cocktails. Michael had the mojito. This is their main course. Mama had mahi-mahi. I had um, chicken and shrimp teriyaki. Michael had the baby rack of lamb. So yeah, this is the inside of the restaurant. Like, look at all of those empty seats, right? And that white lady wouldn't sit us down when we asked for her to sit us down. Um, when we asked a table for three. And it was the Asian lady who, who had us sit down. Which is just, the white lady is just giving us the attitude from the get-go. So anyways, these are our appetizers. That's Michael's mojito. That is the calamari. That is the shao mai. And this is the co coconut shrimp. So the calamari is really good. It has really good uh, marinara sauce. The shrimp coconut is really good with a sweet and spicy sauce. The shao mai, not too much. Um, so this is our main course. No, 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 I'm sorry. This is our salad. The salad is really good. The bread is really good too, but it's kind of oily. So we didn't have our mom eat too much since she can't have unhealthy oil and stuff like that. So now th these are our main courses. Mama had the mahi mahi, that's the fish with hibachi rice. I had chicken and shrimp teriyaki with hibachi rice. Michael had the baby rack of lamb with baked potato. So that's him trying. It's, he, he always has his um, steak medium cooked now. I tried it, but I didn't really like it. I'm not really into steak, but he said that he loved it, that it's fresh. So I trust him. This is Mama's Mahi Mahi. So she can only have like fish now, chicken. She can't have any more fatty food. And this is the inside of Shao Mai. It's made of beef with carrots on top, but I didn't like it. Anyway, 
All right, so with a dessert, it was the white lady who asked us what we want for dessert, and we were asking for the menu, but she wouldn't give it to us. So we just asked for vanilla ice cream. And on their menu, it says French vanilla ice cream with raspberry toppings, right? And this is how it looks on their Facebook photo. And this is what she gave us. She gave us bland, plain vanilla ice cream. Also, um, we asked for our order for our leftovers to be to go to be packed but she just gave us this tyro and the plastic and she had us um do it ourselves when we saw her doing it for other people for other customers so i'm like this lady is really giving us attitude so when i did my um tip i wrote on the receipt that i have a note on the back and this is what i said my tip is not for the long-haired bitchy white lady um <laughs> Because she treat us, treated us differently from other customers. And this is how we looked. With, like, we're really wearing all flip-flops and just... I just can't believe, like, even nowadays, people would treat you based on how they perceive what your status is. And that's just not good. So I just had to give it to her. I had to give her that lesson. Thank you so much. Again, this is your Madame L. Positive Long. Shout out.